are delighted to have the hilarious Oscar-nominated Emmy-winning Melissa McCarthy here with us this morning. Following her star-making turns in Bridesmaids and Identity Fest, she is sizzling hot and she is bringing the heat. You saw how I worked that in? Bringing the heat. That's her her brand new movie. Joining forces with Sandra Bullock as a couple of mismatched uh, law enforcement officers. They're going to take down a drug lord. We're going to take a little bit of a clip and then talk to Melissa. Here it is. The heat help to take down Larkin. You know, you wouldn't even have known about Larkin if it wasn't for me. So obviously the FBI can get information that you can't. Maybe I just need to hear a little, I need your help, Mullins. This is ridiculous, okay? FBI agent. I I'm need not... your help, Mullins. I need your help, Mullins. Is this a whisper party? I want that third floor to hear it. I need your help, Mullins. And then maybe give you a little echo on that Mullins. I need your help, Mullins, Mullins, Mullins. Move, move, move. Even in that, you're annoying. <laughs> First of all, Melissa, it is great, great to see you again. You too. It looked like you all had so much fun. Please tell me it was as much oh fun as it was to watch. It was ridiculous. I mean, it was so fun every day. It's like we're just torturing each other, but laughing at the same time. And she's so funny and so nice that, yeah, every day was kind of, kind of a real treat. You said when you first met, it was like, in your words, fireworks, the two of you. Was that? <laughs> it was. We just, I think we're really similar. Yeah. Like, we have a very similar sense of humor. You know, my youngest is three, hers is three. Like, like the kids got along great. We have very similar obsessions. Like, we're both renovating uh, fanatics. So, like, we were constantly like, have you seen this piece of wood? <laughs> like, and everybody else thought we were wildly boring. But, uh, no. yeah, we just, we have a lot of mutual friends, and it's, the weirdest thing that we've never met, and then finally when we did, we're like, okay, and, yeah, this and, is way overdue. Well, and thank you for acting like there's not smoke blowing over here from Bobby Flay's barbecue. Is this my I mean, I I'm gonna be all misty. Exactly, the wind blown look. See, she smells like ribs. <laughs> That's so weird. I know. What's going on here? But there is something about the magic of YouTube, but also in this film. Let me show this to you. It has heart. I mean, we know it's gonna be funny and it's funny, I but it's so different. Too. It's a little bit different. You know what? You make funny, not mean. And that really means that puts people at ease, Melissa, when they watch. Well, I, I personally don't find it funny when you, when somebody just, I'd rather be the butt of my own joke yeah. than make somebody else the, 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 you know, the punching bag. I just, I just don't care for that kind of humor. I think some people can do it well. It's not my thing. And I think what Paul Feig does and the script that Katie Dippold wrote, they always, you know, you gotta balance the funny with heart. Okay, and we, we are seeing that you are bringing the funny in this oh. dance scene. Oh. That you have with with the sand and, yeah, and this as well. Easy. Now, was that was it choreographed the dance scene, <laughs> or, or did you just, <laughs> no. uh, just just go with it? I think if that was choreographed, someone would be out of a job. <laughs> but we actually talked about it. We said, you know, we're supposed to be beyond tipsy. We're neither one of us should be able to dance that great. And so we literally just played kind of Simon Says. It was like, if you do something, I have to follow. If I do something, you have to follow. So every time we're yelling, like, go left or do that, like, we are literally just making it up as we go. It's magic. It works. <laughs> it, it works. I mean, I mean, busting move like that. And also, you look like a cop. Now, you all, didn't you go to Boston and learn how? Because when you're holding that gun, uh, Melissa? I know. Well, that's I wanted to make sure that if I was, because I have a lot of cops in my family, and I didn't want to be a silly cop. I thought she could be dysfunctional as a person, and her personality could be challenging. But as a police officer, I wanted her to be really good. So I trained with uh, someone from the Boston PD, and everyone in Boston was amazing to us, and we had a great crew from there. But we made sure, and everybody kept saying, like, do not turn that gun on its side. If I know. you turn the gun on its side, we're going to break your wrist. I was like, no, you got no. it. Because the got cops, it. They're, they're watching that, but I hear no, you. No, and you do this, yeah. it's going to, like, ricochet. It's like, it's, no, it's, so it's, a cra it's like videos in weird movies. <laughs> and I understand, you've got really good aim. That's what they were saying. That's really the word on the street. Aim. Ben, my husband and Ben and I went out and did target practice, and I don't know why, and I didn't even have my glasses on, which I probably should have let the officer know that. But uh, yeah, I had good aim. Yeah. Who knew? You, you, you mentioned your husband, Ben, and we're not going to show the clip because we don't want to show everything, but he has a little a cameo, let's say, yes. in, this, in this film as well. It's a good well. cameo for me. <laughs> oh, she loved it. She loved it. <laughs> the last time I saw you, Melissa, was on the red carpet at I the know, Oscars my mom. with your mom. And this is this is what you've dreamed of. I mean, people oh want to say God. you're overnight I'm, excess, but you have worked hard I've for worked where you are this. right now. I, this is very surreal to be sitting here because I lived on 46th Street and for years, and I would walk through here to get to my job 
for about a year and a half, and it's like it's a it's a really crazy thing to be sitting sitting here with you and sitting here in the middle of it of all this like great stuff. Like it's uh, it kind of blows my mind. Well, you've earned it. You have absolutely earned it. And, thank and I have you. that picture of me, you, and my mom up in my office. Do you really? Yeah. That was a special moment. Yeah, that was a special was, moment was, for me, too. Well, thank you. Yeah. I'm glad I'm so not I the only one. I stare at you all the time. <laughs> That's good to know. You make us laugh. You make oh. us happy. And we wish you oh, all you all the very best going forward. Thank and you've you. got to see, because we are bringing the heat right now. We're bringing now. the heat and right. smoke. I know. So the There's heat so smoking. much heat and smoking. <laughs> I mean. You heard it from my last time. Somebody had to say it. Okay, check out the heat coming to theaters.